Hi, we're Joel and Leah. And today we are back to one of our favourite things that we do on YouTube mm. is guessing slang from certain areas. And today <sighs> it is... Florida! Woo! We've got a few viewers in Florida. Yeah, we do. So... Florida's our third biggest state, so you guys... Uh, quite a few of you from Florida. You're present. You're present. And you guys know I love Florida. I've been there many, many, many a time. My parents have a house out there. But looking at some of this slang that you guys have sent us, Never I don't recognise any of it. Okay, well, I'm expecting you to be better than me on this. Okay. <laughs> I've got an easy way out. I think I've been there once in yeah, my life. Yeah, that's true. But we've, we've got quite a few emails about Florida slang. Okay. Um, the first one that popped up was from someone called Brenda. And... I feel like she's having us on. I feel like none of these are real. Okay. Because they're they're not even some of them aren't even really English sounding words. They're just they sound made up and I feel like she's trying to make us look stupid. Okay, well Brenda, if this is all made up, then thank you for the content yeah, for the video. Thank you. But if it's not, then I'm sure our viewers will let us know. Yeah, let in us know comments. in the comments. And guys, stay till the very end of the video because we've got a very special, exciting announcement for you. Right, so the first word is bih. B-I-H. B-I-H. So the example bih. says, can you pass me that bih? Oh, that's got to be beer. Oh, really? Yeah, can you pass me the bih? I thought maybe beer. it was salt. Bih. Beer, yeah, but like Americans beer. say beer. They say like with an oh, R. Yeah. It's only us that say beer. Can you pass me, pass me that B-I-R? Can you pass me the B-I-R? No, B-I-H. Oh, B-I-H, sorry. B B B. B. Um, I think it means salt or could something. Could be baby, pass like me pass me the baby. baby. Pass me the B. beer. Like a child. Yeah, could be. Pass me our child. Let's see. Uh, oh, it says normally a person, place or thing. So it mean basically oh. anything. Oh. Is it, can you pass me that beer? Oh, look at that beer over there. Beer. That's weird. That's is, really that's what, Do you know what I mean by, like, I think this is fake? Yeah, but at the same time, like, in English, in English, in, in, <laughs> in England. England, we might be like, can you pass me that thingy? Thingy. But still, it's more of a thingy, isn't it? Yeah. Can you pass me that? Thingy, look at thingy over there. Yeah, we'd thingy, say thingy. Thingy, thingy, and that could sound like anything, could sound yeah. like thong to you. That's true. Wow. Beer. Beer. I just don't know if we're pronouncing it funny. Beer. How else can you pronounce that? B-I-H. Bye. Ba. 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 I just burped, sorry. Oh. The next one is C-U-H. K. K. And I've not looked at the meaning. K. So, K. If you look at the end of the sentences, she, she gives you an example. example. Okay. Can you tell that K to come over here real quick? That K. Can you tell Does that Does it mean like a stupid person? Like, tell, tell that K to come over here. It does sound like it's... A curse word, but not that harsh on someone. Yeah. Like, you silly cuh. <laughs> you. I say cuh all the time, don't you I? You do, yeah. Like, cuh. Yeah. Meaning, like, your... wow, like, core blimey. Cuh. Cuh. Like, I'm like, oh, that's 150 pounds. Cuh. Yeah, you do do So that. maybe it's an exclamation of, like, wow. Yeah. Okay, it says, refers to any person. Oh, so a bit like beer, then. Beer. Cuh. Beer, cuh. Beer, cuh. Um, <laughs> it's such a can you come over cut. here? That's so weird. so weird. Can you tell that cut to come over here real quick? What about if you say it really quickly? Can you tell that cut to come over here really quick? You'd be like, cut. Can you say what? what? Never. No, never heard that. So the next one is jit, like zit, but with a J. Jit. An example, let me not look at it, saying okay. that jit is mean. Maybe like, that jit. Like that jit is mean. Oh, that little. And then don't speak jit. That S I H T yeah. is instead of that jit. Yeah. Oh, you little you jit. You little jit. Instead of you little. It's got to be another word for a person you don't like. But yeah, it must be. She says, someone that is younger or smaller than you, but either way, it's still used. used. Okay. That's so someone that's smaller or younger than you. That jit. That jit. Like in So Matilda. you're a jit because I'm older. And you're small. You're smaller and younger. And I'm younger, so I'm a jit. You're like such a jit. Oh my I'm gosh, you're jit. the most jitty person I've met. I'm the jittiest jit in your life. You're legit. I'm legit. Legit. Not like, like French, like le jit. Legit. Like the jit. Yeah. But legit as in legit. You crazy. Legitimately. Yeah. Wow. So someone younger, would you call your cousin the little jit then? Yeah, probably. That's what That's what makes me think it's like, because it's like you little, little jit. jit. Like even though you're calling me a jit, I can tell that it's not very nice. Yeah, it's not very nice. I didn't mean it. It's all right. Come in. Thank you. It's all right. He knows it makes it better. <laughs> <laughs> next one. Okay, 
Next one is vibing. Vibing? V I B I N. So we'd be vibing at my sister's house. Now, there's a song I've been listening to on the radio, yeah. and it's like, um, no, 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 vibing. So, um, yeah, we vibing. Yeah, it just means like you're chilling, doesn't it? Like you're. Yeah, no, we'd be vibing. We, if you're vibing, if me and you are vibing, vibing, we're like on the same wavelength, and we're like. We're, we're vibing. We're vibing. We're like, we're on each other's Like right vibe. now, we're probably vibing. We've been vibing for years. Yeah, since 2009. Nine. No, I don't know. 2011. Been... 12. 12. 12, let's 12, say 12. 12, because we're now nearly 2019. Yeah. We've been vibing for a long time. For a long time. Okay. Yeah, to be chilling or to be relaxed. relaxed. Yeah. Oh, okay. We have that in the UK. Yeah. I mean, it's hilarious if someone's like, oh, oh yeah, they'd, they'd be vibing. Vibing, yeah. It's no. unheard of. Especially if you pronounce the G like we're vibing. Vibing. Just doesn't sound good. Oh, yes, okay. yes. Come round, our, come round to my house. We're vibing. We're vibing. Tonight. We're going to vibe tonight, darling. Come Prosecco? round. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's vibing. such a vibe. <laughs> That's how I've heard it say. Like, oh, oh that's, that's that's a vibe. That's such a vibe. Yeah, I've heard that's a mood. Have you heard oh, that? Oh yeah, mood. I love like, that. Like you see something, you go, that's a mood. Meaning like that is amazing. I like, resonate. I resonate with that. that. That's something that's I experience. Thing. So okay. next one is sleep. My teacher tried to assign summer homework. I told her she is sleep. I love that. She is. Sleep. Sorry, you are sleep, <laughs> mate. Being boring, <laughs> you just made surely. It so London. <laughs> you are You're sleep, sleep, mate. <laughs> My she teacher is, so is sleep. sleep. Does it mean that she is so, she is so boring? Almost, but sleep is a good thing. Yeah, we but love sleep. We love don't sleep. We? we do, don't we? Yeah, we do, don't we? Yeah, we really do, don't mm. we? Yeah, we do, we do. don't we? <laughs> yeah, sleep. <laughs> so sleep. obviously, in the context of that sentence, it yeah. makes me think like, oh, my teacher set the homework. That's so annoying. Yeah, but. The word sleep it's to good. us is great. Yeah, when so, you're young though, sleep is not good. You don't want to go to bed. No. But when you hit like mid twenties, you're like, sleep. I love sleep. Yeah. Sleep is everything. Think about the amount of money you'd invest in a bed now. A lot. A lot of money. Yeah. Whereas a child would be like, I don't need a bed. Yeah. I don't sleep. I don't sleep because my teacher is sleep. sleep. <laughs> okay, let's <laughs> okay. see what it says. When someone said or is doing something crazy, crazy. Because sleep's so crazy. I told her she is crazy. Yeah, sleep, sleep is not crazy. I told her she's sleep. Maybe it's like, you're so crazy, you're sleep. You're asleep. You're yeah, because if you're doing something stupid, you might be asleep. So stupid and crazy, but now they've just dropped the A. It's sleep. sleep. That's so good. Seriously, that Leah, you are sleep. It just sounds really London though, doesn't it? That's why we keep saying idea. it like sleep. Yeah. Because it sounds like a Londoner would say that. Imagine if I called you like, got a sleep idea. That's but it's so like funny. I've got a crazy idea. Yeah, crazy idea. I've got a like, sleep idea for a video. That's so funny. Okay, next right, one next is one. slump. Mm -hmm. So like slump. Slump. Slump, I'm guessing it just means the same as ours. Like if you go into a slump, you're tired. Like we get the post-lunch slump. Oh, we had that a couple of hours ago, yeah. didn't we? So the example question mm. uh, statement is she's slumped from how tired she is. Well, yeah. So just yeah, just slumped. Tired. Just like... She's exhausted from how tired from how tired she is. Yeah, instead of exhausted. When right. someone is sleeping or got knocked out in a fight. Oh wow, slumped. She's slumped. So you literally you've been hit in a fight so and now you're out. slumped. Oh, she got slumped oh. in that fight last night. She got a fight at a club and got slumped. slumped. Yeah, That's when cool. you say it like that, it makes yeah. sense. She got slumped in the face. I I wouldn't like to see you in a fight. Even I wouldn't would enjoy I. it. No, even would I? No. <laughs> I don't think I would, you'd survive. I, no, I wouldn't. Because I don't like fighting. No. And I don't like watching fights happen no, either. Me I would, if if someone hurt you, I don't know what I'd do. Yeah. I actually want to cry thinking about it. No, I won't. But if someone like it's knocked okay. you out and you started bleeding, I'd and just I cry. Slumped, yeah, Remember bleeding. when I cried when you sneezed? Yeah, that was, was so, so sad. emotional. It's just like, it was just like, you so unwell. Yeah. Like, I just couldn't handle it. I know. She needs a moment. Just having a moment, like if I just because I imagine you getting beaten up and I didn't like it. Yeah, no, don't imagine that because oh, that's triggering. Okay, the last one yeah. is bus or bussing. We be bussing. Meaning um, that pizza was bussing. Bussin. That pizza was incredible. That was the best pizza I have ever put in my mouth. Or she said that pizza was bus. bus. Yeah. Bus. Oh, but bus, bus in London, maybe like bus bussing. Bussin. That's bussing. Bad. bad. Yeah, maybe. I, yeah, I think bad. Like, like that was ew, bad. that is bussing. Bussin. That pizza was bus bussing. If it was England, I'd be like, that's terrible, bussing. Yeah. But something about Americans don't like buses. 
because we went on a greyhound yeah, they and it hate must be terrible hound. that that pizza was bussing. It must like, mean that the pizza yes. was unreliable, stinky. Made on a greyhound. Made on a greyhound. Found on a greyhound. Oh, it doesn't. It means delicious food. Oh, there's wow. a surprise for everyone there's there, a isn't surprise. there? Um, what a surprise is that one? That is. That's the last of the cycle. It's delicious food. That is bussing. That is absolutely bussing. Well, I still don't know if that is legit Floridian slang. I'm sorry, Brenda. I don't mean to offend you, but just, you know, some people try to trick us, and I'm just. A if bit. Cut. Part of Jit. me is hoping that it was all a trick, but we'll find out in yeah. the comments. Guys, let us know if you're from Florida and you've heard of these things, and also let us know if these are things that are said outside of Florida, because I'm aware sometimes we do slang and they're like, that's Crossover. not Arkansas slang, I say that in Ohio. And I say it in Virginia. Yeah, so <laughs> let us know if it's just Florida, or if it's elsewhere as well. And if you want us to guess slang from where you're from, yeah. send it to us. Yeah. There is our contact details below. Uh -huh. Paste it in the comments, maybe. Yes. But it's what's really helpful is if you send one email with the slang and then like like lower in the email, then yep. say all the meanings so yep, that we so don't accidentally read the meanings. Words with examples Oops. and then the answers would be really, really helpful. helpful. Thanks for Thanks. doing our research for us, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh. There was one more at the top we didn't read out. Was there? Yeah, it said word, but I think we both really? knew it. Yeah, there was one. It was just um, honestly, it said. Yeah, no, that was the thing saying the word and oh. meaning. You're such an idiot. I thought it said word, like this is number one. Imagine if we no, get that. No, it's the title of the thing. Words here, meanings here. <laughs> she did it in a in a chart, and the top line was word, and the second bit was meaning. They should have been in bold. Sorry, Brenda. <laughs> Brenda, it's all your fault. <laughs> so the exciting announcement is that it's round two of Joel and Liam merch. Collection two is launching tonight at 8 p.m. It's AmericanLegend.co.uk and you can get your hands on these. So we realised when we launched Collection 1 that most of you guys are from hot places yes. and we were the idiots that launched jumpers and hoodies in summer. up to our stupidity so and sorry. we say to you we're very sorry not one person in that meeting thought about the weather and there was plenty no, of us in the room there was and we we went into our meeting for this collection too and we told them and they were like oh yeah, oh, yeah. they're like how did none of us think of that like yeah because we're so consumed in our own weather at the moment which is sometimes warm and most of the time not warm so we're just like yeah hoodies, hoodies. and jumpers so we've launched t-shirts we've got some unisex t-shirts um, and then we've got some women t-shirts which yes. have a scoop neck. Leah will model it for you now. Lovely ladies neckline. Yeah. So nice on as well. It's so good. I keep getting messages because I did tease this on Instagram. Uh -huh. And I keep saying, get the skinny legend pink top you're wearing. Will we be able to get those? Yes, well, you can. we will. As of tonight. We're so excited. So this range also skinny legend. And we just want to make it clear for those, if you're new to this channel, it has nothing to do with your physical size at no. all. A skinny legend is internet slang for someone who is amazing. Like yeah. 
anyone who's amazing is a skinny, skinny legend. legend. So don't get it confused with the traditional meaning of what skinny means. Yes. I mean, our sizes, we're going, what size are we going up to with this? I can't remember. I we'll put it on screen. 2XL, but I think we it's can 2XL. double check with these um, ones. So you don't have to be, it's not a size thing. So no. don't get confused. Also, don't get it twisted. Don't get it twisted. Don't get your hats twisted either. Yeah. We've also got the pink skinny legend hat. So nice. We've got the blue skinny legend hat. Uh huh. And yes, the unisex tees. You guys might have seen we wore these at the beach the other day. And we wore so them around cool. Tesco and we were yeah, getting we smacked. Yeah, we wore them at the supermarket. It was just so much fun and we're really excited for this range of merch. And if you're a little bit of a collector, then you might want to get your hands, especially on the hats. I think the hats make a really cool collector's item. Yeah, they really do. If you're do. like, you've got the legend, the skinny legend. Who knows what other things we might do in the future. Exactly. Um, and, you know, if you've got any of our OG triggered merch yeah. or not my vibe merch, let us know in the comments what you have loved the most of the merch we've released. Definitely. But as normal, this collection is very limited. It's only available for 48 hours. We want to keep it exclusive. We don't want to have a merch shop that's just up all the time for mm -hmm. people to buy things. We want to keep it nice and exclusive. So once this merch has gone, it's, it's gone. gone. And we really mean that. We hope you've understood that from last time. I think people were like, oh, that le those Legends hoodies, like you they'll say 48 hours, but they'll be back. No, no, like they're gone now, it so expires. we're not going back. Like even if our best friend was like, we need, I really mm. want a hoodie, there's actually nothing we can do. No. And I know that not because being she made. asked us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then you gave her one of yours. I gave her one of mine yeah. and it was really surreal seeing someone else that's not you or me wearing yeah. our merch. It looks really good on her though. Oh, yeah. Sky lovely. blue ones are lovely. Lovely, <laughs> lovely. But yeah, that's the exciting that's announcement. News. Thanks for watching this video. Um, if you enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe. We post videos thrice, thrice weekly, weekly, twice on this channel, once, once on our solos. Personals. Solos. That's good. We should do that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, do it again. Okay. We <laughs> post videos thrice, thrice weekly, weekly, twice on this channel, once on our solos. Or individual, whatever you want to say. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. We cool. Tried. We're learning, guys, because we've dropped down from three videos a week to, to two. two. Um, but yeah, come back next time. We'll see you see very soon. soon. Bye. Bye.